Hi everyone, today we're going to be doing the part 2 of the U.S. state battle. I think I might have to reverse this one, even though, you know, I want to take my time, but I can't. So, yeah, let's get straight into it and pick a random state to start off from. New Mexico. If this chooses war, then it's going to be the only one with a 30-pointer. Anyways, let's get the wheel. Okay, so alliance. This is going to be the second alliance that we choose from. So, yeah, let's pick another random state. Wyoming. Where's Wyoming? I don't know. Oh, yeah, it's right there. So, New Mexico and Wyoming. Oh, Philly's in. Yep. Mexico, not Colorado, and Wyoming. Yeah, that's weird. Tell you all from then. Okay. So now we have New Mexico and Wyoming. So that means New Mexico, if it attacks something, or Wyoming attacks something. It's 100% gonna win because of the point system and, and because of the alliance. All right, next state, Alabama. I know where that is. So now, Alabama really can't attack Georgia. Alliance again? Okay then! So, oh my gosh. I accidentally spin again, but we're still gonna go with Alliance because it still lands on Alliance. Okay, pick a random state. Michigan. That's a really good one for them. Let's get in the yellow color. Alabama and Michigan. Now Michigan isn't the now New Mexico is the, only, in, the only one that has some help with three points now. Wait. Oh wait, it can't work out. I just realized that. I'm so sorry, Alabama. But Michigan is a democracy, is a monarchy, and you're nothing. So you can't, you can't do anything. Too bad, so sad. Bye. North Dakota. No, that's good. If they form an alliance with South Dakota, which oh yeah, they can. not all right then, let's spin the wheel. Please don't land in lines again. Oh, oh my, war, war. War. Let's spin the arrow. Where's it going? It can't attack up. So let me just like, oh, to the west. Now. The thing is, Montana is bigger, so North Dakota just killed itself for no reason. Damn, that's sad. Trying to take over another state without permission, and it's Montana to the west of you with more land. I'm already from the name Montana because I want it to be like all over the state. So yeah. 
Actually, let me just get white here right now. So then it won't be like messed up. Montana. And it actually fits. Texas might have competition. That's good. Okay, next date. Tennessee. I think I know where Tennessee is. Oh yeah, I know where it is. Let's see what he gonna do. Get some ideology. And his ideology press might help him. Oh my, I predicted the future. He got an ideology. Let's go. He got an ideology. Okay. Now let's see what ideology he's gonna get. Weird. Communism? Okay. So, the third communist country or state. I'm not really calling it. Get that hammer and sickle. Now we have three communist countries, one monarchy. Now the next state. None. Arkansas. Oh my. It already has an ideology. So you might be getting a new ideology and you might get help from Michigan. So now let's see what we're gonna get. You're gonna lose if you choose war. You're totally gonna lose. War, okay. Now let's see who the lucky ducky is. To get Arkansas. Oh, Mississippi. I don't know. I'm gonna search it up. Um. Ten. Arkansas square mile, 53,000, Oh my, Arkansas, you're so lucky that you've just taken over Mississippi, bro. I forgot about the whole ideology thing. Yeah. Just mend the walls. Down, down, down. Now let's erase the name because I'm. Uh, Get this. Now it's got the white coloring. Arkansas. Bro, that is a big name. Okay, let's shorten it down. And it's still too big. Still too big. Arkansas. Let's get the ideology in here, too. There we go, Arkansas. Could have gotten help from Tennessee and South Dakota. No. Okay, next state. Now, Arkansas um, is bigger than Oklahoma and Iowa, but still smaller than like Utah, Colorado, definitely New Mexico. <coughs> Anyways, next one. Louisiana. 
Oh yeah, I've seen, I see it, I see it. Now let's see what you're gonna do. If you choose war, you lose, you automatically lose. Oh! Alliance. Now let's see which lucky ducky is gonna have you on their team. Utah. That's a good one. That's a really good one. It's her size, of course. Okay, we only have five more minutes left, so we need to get this done fast. Washington. Since Washington does not exist anymore, we're going to give it to New Mexico. I'm sorry I had to take a bath and now I'm eating breakfast. There's like orange stuff in my bread, so, and it tastes good, so yeah. Mm. Mm. It tastes so good. <clears throat> so yeah, we're just gonna get in the state. North Dakota, which is Montana. See what they're gonna get. Sorry if I'm not talking loud enough. Ideology. Go. Let's see which one they're gonna get. Could be communism, could be monarchy. And there's cardinal. Why is it that every single ideology just like it matches? Like, we have one, two, three. No more. There's more, 100%. Four. Tennessee, I missed it. Four communism. I missed. Oh, yeah, I forgot to give one. Montana. To that's not big enough. I'll put the points here then. Montana has two points. I'm gonna see if I missed anything. Hmm. Hmm. No, no, I didn't miss anything. Hmm. Let's get this. Oklahoma. If they land on war, I think they're dead. Most of them. Ideology is them. I swear I'm not setting this up. This is just like... Just uses so just like ideology things. Monarchy, finally. So it's just draw a crown in there. Don't mind the sounds. Mm. The last state we're going to modify is New Hampshire. Oh, I thought it would be dead to Maine. Well, I'll see what it does. War. In the air. That's Massachusetts. Hmm. 
9.3 thousand. And you know, Massachusetts is a tour. Like I said, it's gonna be the final one we do. So this is the map now. Nothing has happened to most of the states, but it's definitely more colorful. And kind of good, though. Better, I would say. Okay, that's it for today. Bye.